So I wanted to show a video of one of my new Scentsy Warmers. I love it. It is the Alabaster Warmer. Um, oh, it's so gorgeous. I also, it comes with a regular um, light bulb, but I purchased a separate bulb, which is blue. I don't know if you can tell, but it does glow blue. It's beautiful. It's a 25 watt bulb warmer, of course. Um, and the texture of it is so cool. Like it's, it's like a rough texture. It's not smooth. It is so awesome. Uh, you can put up to four cubes in here. I love the shape of this. You know, not your typical round dish. Um, I just think it looks very modern and sleek and you can change up the colors because they have like, I think they have a red bulb, orange bulb, green bulb, blue, and purple, which this would look gorgeous with the purple. Oh, it would look good with any of the other colors actually. So you can kind of change it out to different themes for the year, but I just chose blue because I just thought it would look gorgeous and it does. So, and um, this warmer is not really expensive. I think it was like $30, um, 25 or 30, I can't remember, one of the two. I think it was 30. So it's a, a bit more affordable warmer. Um, and then it's got the toggle switch right there. So yeah, I'm trying to think, is there anything else I need to say about this warmer? I don't think so. I just think it is gorgeous. And yeah, it's melting very well. So it's pretty, y'all. Okay, here's another warmer that I purchased. This is the um, aloe vera warmer. Um, I don't remember the price on this guy. Um, of course, it is a hot plate. It is 12 watts. It has um, a little red indicator when it's on. It's got the toggle switch, which you can see right back there. Um, basically, the warmer that you get is just this, and it's a really nice ceramic. It's, um, what am I trying to say? You can see on the leaves how it's crackled, like got a crackle finish on it. Basically, what I did is I went up to the Dollar General. I got this wooden tray, which is called, I think, a dough tray or a bread tray, dough tray, something like that. But anyway, I picked up one of these. I had these little rocks. Um, I bought the little, I already had the pebble, little pebble rocks that I put in all around the warmer. I sat it down in there. Um, it's sitting on a piece of styrofoam that actually came with the warmer to kind of raise it up a little bit. And then I put the rocks around it. And then I bought some of these bigger rocks and put in. And then I already had these like fake succulents. Uh, I've had these for quite a few years. And so I decided to go ahead and make this look like, hold on, let me see if I can get up here without falling. <laughs> um, I decided to make it look like a little aloe vera plant, which I have a real one, but this is just so cool. And you can leave this out year round. I mean, it's just gorgeous. Um, yeah, like I said, it's a 12 watt, which is awesome. It does melt the wax very well. I just turned this on, so it is slowly in the process of melting, but it just looks so cute. So I just wanted to show y'all that, and there are so many ways. You could put it like in a regular pot, any kind of planter, any kind of little deal that you wanna um, stick it in and jazz it up a little bit, so. There you go. Um, yeah, I think it's gorgeous. So, hope you all have a wonderful day. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I am here with another Scentsy haul. This is just a small haul, but I thought I would grab a few things. So, let's get into it. And I'm really impressed, by the way, with the throw of this stuff. These are 
3.2 fluid ounces. Um, this first one right here is Welcome Summer. And Welcome Summer is Watermelon, Plumeria, and Tropical Waters. Mm. This is definitely a watery scent. I get the Plumeria and like a, a watery vibe. I don't smell watermelon. So that one is a big gift for the summer. Next one is aloe water and cucumber. And aloe water and cucumber is aloe water, cucumber peel, palm frond, and pineapple nectar. That noise in the background, my cat is in her cat box. Of course, she's going to decide to do that while I'm doing a video. Oh, this one is really refreshing. I definitely get that aloe. I don't really smell cucumber peel. I can kind of get like a palm frond type of note with this too. Um... But it's mainly like aloe and palm frond. Really green and watery and fresh. Okay, this next one is Blue Grotto. I've decided that this is one of my very favorites. I love this scent. Fresh tropicals, citrus, and lush botanicals. This one is just, it's sweet and it's fruity, and it's very citrusy, more on the orangey citrus. Yeah, it's just really refreshing. It's just a bright citrus. Um, almost like a bright orange to me, but it's got other stuff going on in there. It's, it's not straight up orange. All right, the next one I got is Autumn Road Trip. And Autumn Road Trip is, where is it? Oh, Harvest Apple, Anjou Pear, and Silver Oak. No, I definitely get that oak. I can smell a little bit of pear in here. Um, I do get a slight hint of apple, but I get pear and oak. And it's very crisp. I like that one. Kind of almost a little bit like cologne-y, um, but it's good. This next one is Honey Pear Cider. And honey pear cider is fresh, juicy pear, sweet honey, ginger root, and cinnamon and clove. Okay. I get the cinnamon and clove. I get pear. I don't know that I smell the ginger, but it does have a sweetness, which I'm attributing to the sweet honey. This one is really good. And the clove is stronger than the cinnamon. And I like, I like clove. All right. This next one is very merry cranberry, which is lush red winter berries and cedar. Mmm, this one is really good. It's got a sweet berry to it. And then you do get that cedar note in here. It's, uh, 
Definitely smells like cranberries to me, like a sweet cranberry. Mm, that would be a beautiful uh, winter scent. Next one is winter, winterberry apple tea. And this one is winter tea, cranberry, apples, and honey. Mm, this is good. I definitely get the tea note. It's, it's like a hot tea. Like maybe a black tea is what it smells like to me. Um, and I do get the apple note. But it's like a, a baked apple, a cooked apple, not a fresh apple. And it does smell like it has some spice to it. Not really cinnamon though. Maybe more like clove. I don't smell cranberry or honey. But that's a good combo. All right, this next one is apple cherry strudel. An apple cherry strudel is Granny Smith apple, cherry, and vanilla drizzle. Mm. This one is delicious. Okay, I can smell the cherry. It's almost like a tart cherry to me, though. You get a little bit of that apple, but it is not overwhelming, like strong. It smells like a cherry pie or not pie. It doesn't have like the, the crust note. It's more of like, it says a strudel. You get that kind of dough, cooked dough. Like, like one of those cherry hand pies, I guess you would call it more of like a note like that. Mm. That's just a really good bakery if you like cherry. Okay, and then we have Dancing Sugar Plums. And Dancing Sugar Plums is Spice Plum, Cinnamon, Apple, and Vanilla. Mm. You definitely get that spiced plum right off the bat. I can smell the vanilla in here too. Not so much uh, cinnamon apple. It smells just like a rich spiced plum with vanilla mixed in. It, it, it would be like in the, the foodie category. Okay. Then I got some car bars and I have to say my car bar that I put in my car lasted about two weeks. I mean, it's still kind of going, but it's not as strong. It's going on the third week. I can still kind of, but very strong for two weeks. Then it's kind of been tapering off, but these are lasting way longer than any other air fresheners I've ever put in my car. Um, I love them. So I got one in a blue grotto. I'm very impressed with these. I picked up one in B. Mary. And the B. Mary is Pine Bows, Holly Leaf, and Cassis. Like I said, I'm not going to open these because you don't want to open it until you're getting ready to put it in your car. And then I got an Amazon Rain. <clears throat> And Amazon Rain is Melon, Orange Zest, Coconut Milk, Night Blooming Jasmine. So I'll be excited to sniff that one. Okay, and then I got a body care item. Um, I wanted to try it to see how much I like it. I got their body wash in Go Go Mango and it is Mango, Melon, Hibiscus, and Banana Flower. So this is their Go Go Mango, and it is 7.7 .7 fluid ounces. Mm -hmm. 
I can't twist this top off. And I'm trying to smell it through this little tiny baby hole. <laughs> what I can smell of it, it smells good. I definitely get like mango and melon. So I'm anxious to see how this one works out, you know. Okay, and something else I wanted to show you was the Scentsy Buddies. Um, I got their Scentsy Buddies on clearance for my grandkids for Christmas. And I just wanted to show you these. These are so cute. I got a goofy Scentsy Buddy. It is so cute. I love the box. And it's even got... You can punch these out, I guess, and make it a handle and use it as a carrying thing. Carrying, you know, you can keep the Scentsy Buddy in the box and then carry him around. But let me show you this guy. These were in the clearance section. This is Goofy. Oh my gosh. He has got the Scentsy logo on his foot. Just look at this guy. He's got his cute little goofy hat. Oh, and these are so soft. And the bottom is like kind of like a corduroy. He's got his little vest. He's so cute. He's got the little sensi star right there. It's just adorable. And in the back right here, there is a zipper. You unzip him. And there's a pouch in there, or I mean a pocket in there. And what you do with that, as I'll show you, they, I got three of these and they all came with this little, what's it called? A uh, Scentsy Scent Pack. Okay, these all came with this one. Some of them, uh, the ones not on clearance, you can pick your own scents. I don't remember the scent notes, but it kind of smells like I know it's not, but it kind of smells like baby powder. It's really nice. Mm. And then you just take the scent pack out. It's in it, it, scent packs has these little beads in it. You put this whole pack inside the buddy. And that way, when the little ones like cuddle and snuggle up to them, they can uh, have that scent. So I will, I will put these back in their respective boxes in a minute. Okay. The next one I got is Donald Duck. Donald Duck. I'm sorry. I know there's a glare from that oh, sun. I'm trying, I'm using my phone because my camcorder is so old. That thing, it just won't focus anymore. My videos are so blurry and it's just, it's a bummer. <laughs> okay. Here is Donald. Isn't he adorable? He's got the little tuft of hair there. His little bow. His little sailor outfit. The cute little tail. Scentsy on his foot. And of course he has a Scentsy star right there. And then he's got a place. Uh on his back right here the zippers right here to put the little scent pack in but he is flipping adorable and they are so soft and his hands are like the corduroy he's so cute so cute i love him okay those are for the two grandsons then i got daisy duck For the only granddaughter. I got a piece of hair stuck on my hand. God. Gosh darn it. Let's show you Daisy. Look at her. Look at her. Look at that beautiful pink bow. Her big eyelashes. <gasps> Cute little dress and she's got this is like a hard plastic her little uh bracelet 
And of course she has the like corduroy hands, soft body. She's got her cute little pink shoes. It's, yeah, Scentsy on the bottom of this one. She is adorable. She's got the cute little pink tail, that, and of course the zipper for the pouch to go into. And I don't know if I'm gonna put these pouches in this, in these ones, or maybe order separate ones in sense that I think the kids would like better. But oh, these are so cute. I love it. Oh, and these also aren't just for the Scentsy Buddies. You can also put these in your closets, in your dresser drawers, under the seat of your car, um, anywhere you need some freshening up. So that is my Scentsy haul. Um, thank you all for watching. And I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.